TV once a day, every day, turn on the machines, and then we start talking. And we'll be here for an hour. It's your daily hour of the week, Sunday. Yeah, Sunday, fun day. Yeah, hi Alex, how you doing? Great. It's Alex. She's back. When was the last time you were here? Probably a couple weeks, maybe three. Three yeah. weeks? Where's the calendar? Yeah. Three weeks, maybe, and so you were uh, in the California. Yeah, I was in California. What'd you do? Sunshine. What'd you do in California? <laughs> Nothing. We just nothing. Act like bums. Actually, we did a lot. Actually, we went to the Angel Stadium and went to the church service. In L.A. Yeah, the stadium was packed out for this church service. Oh, there was a church church at the stadium. Yeah. Did they rent it? Yeah. And it was free admission. And we were hung out, hung out with Erica and her brother for a while and her grandma. That was fun. And then we went to Malibu. That was even funner. Whoa. Malibu is my favorite part of California. What's the Malibu? The beach, beach yeah. town. Yeah. Super beautiful. Did you go to uh, in and out Burger? Yeah, we went there, but I didn't get anything to eat. Neither did James. What? But we went there. Why didn't you eat anything? Because I don't like that stuff. Uh, and James was like, James like has to be high in order to eat. What? So he didn't have any weed for like seven days. So that's why he didn't eat any in and out Burger. What? Yeah. He literally smokes that much. Uh, like literally, what? if he's not smoking weed, he cannot eat anything. Uh, uh-oh. Yeah. Does he have a problem? Maybe you should get a help. It sounds like he has a dependency. Yeah. He does. Hmm. But, yeah. Well, that's bad. Yeah. So, what did he, he starved? Yeah, he starved for a few days. Like, he literally didn't eat anything. For what? Was, at least, like, five days. And then his dad came and brought him weed. And then... Well, don't, he <laughs> you, should, you shouldn't be saying that stuff. Well, his dad is, I don't know. What are you talking about? That's crazy stuff. <laughs> That's bad stuff. Don't be doing that stuff, kids. <laughs> I know. I know. Wow. But, I mean, like, it, like at first, like, he couldn't eat anything, and then, like, as the days went on, he could, like, eat a little bit more, but, like, he still couldn't eat that much until his dad What's came. Because of his other problems with drugs or what? That's why is he doing that? It's That's bad. just because of weed. Just because he, like, he literally smokes every single day, stoned, 24 hours. And when he, we went to California, like, he couldn't bring any weed on the plane, so he didn't have any. So then he couldn't eat because, like, he wasn't hungry for some reason. Because he wasn't high, I guess. That's bad. <laughs> I know. That's very bad. You shouldn't be doing that, James. You're getting yourself into a bad situation. <laughs> I know, but... Wow, well, well, did you have fun, though? You, I mean, he, was, he must not have been much fun. He must have been cranky. No, he was fine, you actually. Even eating, though? Actually, <laughs> there was a situation where we, we rented a convertible, and it was fun and great, and he was, like, freaking out. Like, we parked in front of this really huge mansion in uh, Malibu, and we were going to sleep in the car. And James started freaking out, like, slamming his head on the thing, like, what? literally crazy. Like, I wasn't even saying anything because I was so scared of him. Yeah. So he was just, like, freaking out. He, like, wasn't high. Like, his phone was dead. And I was like, James, we can just go somewhere and plug it in real quick. Like, we can go to a store and plug it in. He's like, I'm not going to do that. I'm not homeless. Blah, blah, blah. Like, just pride and all this other stuff. He was mad because his phone was off? Yeah, and then I was like, James, we That's can he, he, plug it in. He hit his head on the store. chair just because his phone was off? Yeah, and because he didn't want to <laughs> sleep in the car because he felt like he was waiting for drugs, which is, like, understandable, but it's Ooh, like, you're no. not waiting for drugs. You're not at all. And he just starts, like, freaking out, yelling at me, just going crazy, and I wasn't saying anything. Oh, no. Like, no. <laughs> yeah. James has addictive problems. <laughs> yeah. But I think he's getting better, hopefully. He has problems with addiction. That's sad. Yeah, I think he feels really bad. Like, he felt really bad the next day, like, 
we went into Starbucks to charge our phones and like he said sorry and stuff, but it's still. Oh no, is that why you didn't bring him here? Where is he? He's not here today. He he just, he, he, I could have brought him, but I just really felt like I wasn't supposed to bring him yet, so I didn't. You were spending, after the, the head, when was that headbutting incident? Was that in the middle of your trip? <laughs> or? Yeah, that was like probably after like the first week. And then. Out of two? Yeah, that was like the Sunday. Yeah. So that was like in the middle. And then it was fine and whatever. And we, whatever, it was great, whatever, because he got weed and then. <laughs> but then like, I don't know, like it was just so crazy. And then I asked him to help me with my backpack and he freaked out and he started yelling at me. Oh, I asked no. him to help me with my backpack. Yeah. That's what, so those are, the, are those the most memorable, memorable <laughs> stories from California? You no. know, in California you're talking about James and his addiction problem? <laughs> no. Um, we, we actually, it was really cool. We didn't know where we were going to go. And my friend lives in San Diego and she was like, hey, my, my mom will like host you guys. And I was like, okay. But she wasn't even there. So we went there. I've never met her mom. Neither has James. Her mom picked us up from the train station at 12 o'clock at night. She had never met her ever. Uh-huh. And then so she let us sleep there. And then Molly, uh, and then her dad took me and James like on a tour, and her dad took us to the beach, and her dad took us out to lunch, and then her dad took us to go pick up Molly from school, and then Molly was kicking it with us for an hour, and then Molly left to go to this camp thing, and then the, her parents were like, oh, you guys can just take the car around, we're gonna go to a dance class, but you guys can just take our car, drive around, drive around San Diego, go to the beach, here's the computers, do whatever you want, like crazy, like they never met us in their lives, and it was really cool. Wow. Yeah, it was really cool. So we got that. We got to do that. So, and then we got to do a lot of other stuff. But yeah. Did Did you see any crying babies on the plane there? Um, no. But we did see dolphins. Where? In Malibu, we were like on this like huge cliff, and we saw the dolphins in the water, like really close to shore. It was really cool. What did they do? They were just in a pack, and they were just like <laughs> jumping, kind of, and they're, you know, whatever. <laughs> Bless you. Yeah, I was sneezing. Did you, there were wild dolphins? Yeah. Wow. Did you see uh, any, uh, like, the Chinese theater or the... Yeah. Or maybe Disneyland? Yeah, <laughs> we didn't see Disneyland, but we saw the Chinese theater. And that's on Hollywood Boulevard, I think. Yeah. Well, I think. Yeah, we saw that. And, um... Well, famous people. You see any famous people? I wish. <laughs> yeah. We got to drive up in the Hollywood Hills and we saw all where they make all the porn in those houses. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Did you see any porn people? Probably, I don't know. <laughs> they don't stick out. You're not to LA people look like porn people to me. Yeah. <laughs> Here's a message. So, Mr. Well, Ginsu. I, I just talked to my mom about a half hour, 45 minutes or something. A new record. I must be feeling better. <laughs> Normally. Talking to his mom. My mom. Fuck. Sitting with my mom and that we talked about two minutes, two to five minutes, and that's about all she can stand. Me. <laughs> um, yeah. Other things and whatnot. I guess I could be slightly annoying at times. Uh, yeah. <laughs> what are you talking about? I don't know. <laughs> Whatever. He's talking know. to his, uh... Anyway, motherfucker, uh-huh. I don't want to tell you. You've been doing a good job lately. Oh, great. Thank you. What did he say? A couple weeks ago. Or he like said we've been doing a good job. Oh. Uh, the show was on at least once, so... Yep, yep, he did a pretty fucking good job getting the show on at least once. Yep. So that's all I can expect of you people, at least once a week, right? Uh huh. Yep, yep. I'll have to go with that, I guess. Yep. I had something else to say about whatever the fuck, I can't remember what the fuck it was. I never can by the time fucking the answer machine gets around. Uh huh. Jeez, Chris. I need to get me something to write this down on, for sure. Yeah. But it seems like a pain in the ass to, to write something down because I can tell you that's a fuck What over. is he saying? I'm not sure. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm just saying, yeah. Um, yeah, I think he does, and he... 
He is, uh, can't get out of bed, so I don't know how much energy he has. Hey, look, it's time for the dice game. Are you guys ready for the dice game? What happens here, you guys, viewers, you do this too, get a pen out. And we're going to write a number on our hands here. I still have my number from yesterday. There's a pen above your head. If we can't find the other pen. Okay. All right. Charlie gets a three. Charlie! Oh, uh-oh. Yeah, what's he doing over there? Camera went out. There it goes. Charlie! Charlie! Hey! There he is over there. What's he doing? You get a three, you ready? Yeah. Alright, I think he's ready. Three. Oh. Oh, what is it, three and six? Yeah. Charlie, you got it! Woo. Charlie, you got it! Hey! You got it! He doesn't oh. care. Doesn't seem to care. <laughs> oh, uh oh. Whoa. What'd you have? A one. I had a five. Yeah, you always choose one, right? Yeah. yeah. I'm excited to give this back to James. I think I'm going to stop by his house on the way home. Oh, yeah? Because I have, I, like, he brought a knife to California, and I had to put it in my luggage, so I have to give that back to him. Uh-huh. So I'm going to, yeah. You think that he's going to be okay without that? I, I thought who, we found out who this thing was. This James's. Yeah. I thought it was going to kill him, or I thought he was going to die. He didn't have it, you know? No, he actually, yeah, he could have, but he has a lot more. Oh, okay. So. It's dangerous to not do that stuff. Oh, Mr. Ginsu left a ton of messages today. Did he? Yeah, should we listen to some more of them? No, I don't know. You don't want to listen to them? I mean, sure. Maybe we can listen to some of them. We can, uh, should we call James? Oh, yeah, we can call James. You have his new phone number? Yeah. We'll tell him that maybe he has an addiction problem, I guess. No, don't tell him that. He'll get mad. Oh, well, you told... Oh, what the... Oh, it's, uh, Lisa. Hello, hello, caller. <laughs> oh, yeah, hello. Is the program over or has it started? Oh, uh, we've already started. Hi, it's a pro Hi. I'm checking on Charlie. Yeah, Charlie, he's, he's over there. Did the program, did the program start? It started. We're about ten minutes in. Ten minutes in. Yeah. Do you have Charlie there? Yeah. You do? Okay. Anything else, Lisa? We'll be there soon. Oh, okay. Oh, this is Lisa's mother, right? Okay. Lisa's mother? This is the old lady. The old lady. The old yeah. lady. No, he didn't. He said it's just Lisa's mom. I said it's, I mean, old lady. This is me. All right. Well, thank you. We'll see you in a minute. Or a bit there. Okay. We'll see you in a little while. Okay. Okay. Uh-oh. Okay. Uh uh huh. Don't talk to him about the addiction though, because he'll get like literally get mad. But well, you you shouldn't be saying things that you don't want to tell him about on the program. Oh, well, I'll tell him about it in real life. Are you going to? Is he gonna watch this episode and find out and be mad about that? He probably won't watch the episode, but he probably won't be mad about it. But okay, well, we're gonna pretend like we didn't talk about it. I guess you can just ask him <laughs> how his time went. Just asking nice things and talking about the things that you brought up. <laughs> Why talk about it? You don't know. Oh, he's gonna bring it up himself. You yeah, okay. have reached the. Sprint, Wait, voice mailbox of two, five, uh, three. Uh, Sometimes it fails. Oh, that was his old number, I think, isn't it? No. It, it wasn't? So we have that name, number saved, the one that you just gave us, so maybe that is the one we have. Okay, try it again. Sometimes it fails. James from Lakewood. <laughs> it's those Lakewood phones. They don't work. The best, I guess. Did you want a plane back up here too? Yeah. You have reached a oh. uh -oh. voice mailbox. Of well, something's gone wrong with that. Who knows? Um. Yeah, we did. We wrote a plane from San Francisco. Mhm. Mm and that was good. Um. James was really excited to go home. <laughs> oh yeah. He he was he didn't. Yeah. He's tired of California. Tired of tripping down trip. No. I mean, I think he, I don't know what he's tired of really. He's probably just had it himself. It's a lot of, a lot of time. You guys go to hotel rooms and stuff. Yeah, a, a lot. Every night we got a hotel room that we didn't, where we weren't at someone else's house. Whoa. What's the best hotel you stayed at? Um, I don't know. Did you see any any scary oh, hotels? Hey, Billy. Oh, <laughs> hey, hey, Freddie. 
Hello? Hey, hello, can you hear me? Hey, guys. Hello. How's the show going? Great. It's Alex. Hey. I uh, just got some lunch at the Fishtail Brewery. I'm walking back to my house, and uh, there's a train on the train track. Whoa, Good don't go. Exciting. What? I don't know what it's doing. Alex is here. Yeah, it's in the tunnel. Oh, did you see Freddie oh, in California? Alex. Did you oh. guys meet up? No, I didn't see Freddie in California because Chico is eight hours away from where we were. Oh, that's pretty far. Yeah. <laughs> so that's why. Yeah. Did you guys go to the, um, the same places? Did you go to that... that uh, we we went through Chico on our uh, Greyhound ride, and I thought I mean it looks kind of weird to me, but it was whatever. Did you go to the split pea soup place? No. Oh, you didn't have a car, huh? No. How did you get around? We uh, took trains and buses and taxis and everything. Oh. Uh, well, hey, Freddie, how's the how's the production end coming? It's going good. I got um, yesterday's episode captured. I couldn't find the ep the episodes. Uh, from the the dozen said were captured up until Friday, but I'm gonna I'm gonna keep working on it. It's kind of nice having it back in my house. I got a little spot set up for it, and uh, gonna take those files over to the TV station tonight and put them in the Dropbox, and everything should be back scheduled tomorrow. Great. What time yeah. is that? What time Thanks. is that thing on Wednesday? Uh, in the afternoon. Like if from maybe two to four or five or something like that. Oh, okay. Yeah. We're gonna be uh, eating hamburgers. I think. Cool. Swell. I'm very excited about that. I'm looking forward to the kickoff. Do you, do you have a grill? Two whole years. Two, two whole years. years. Two years of programming. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. Two years every day we've been doing the show. It's gonna be also it's gonna be the season premiere. Or oh, wait, finale? It? Season finale? The season finale is today, is Thursday, and then the new season starts on, uh, on Friday. Is that what we're doing? We're going to do two-year kickoff, then season finale, then season premiere? I mean, as that's how it works out, unless we want to do them all combined and have it be a short or a season or something, I don't know. I like, I like three days of events. Yeah, yeah, three days in a row. Oh, uh, that's pretty exciting. So that's going to be a really exciting week coming up here. On Wednesday, it's going to be our two-year kickoff. And then... And then we're going to do the season finale, finale. And then the day after is the season premiere. Oh, Yeah, okay. we don't take breaks between yeah, the, yeah. the finale. You know, usually on TV, they, they do the season finale because then you got to wait. But not here. <laughs> you just do the season finale. We do the season premiere the next day. No waiting. Yeah. Because we're in the new fall season. No waiting. No waiting. We pretty much, uh, yeah. No yeah. waiting. We uh, are falling right on the regular seasons with TV also the, this this year. Oh yeah. <laughs> are you excited for the new fall season of TV? We don't take break. We don't take any season breaks, you know. Yeah, we, we just do every season. Hiatuses. Are you gonna watch the new fall season of television? No. I no. Don't know. If I want to. You don't have any plans to? No. There's no new. What about? Uh, any new uh, stuff on the on the Jesus channel? You watch that channel? No. You don't watch it? <laughs> no. You think you think that's uh, that those people are uh, taking taking money for for the Jesus thing and maybe that that's bad? I don't know. I just think they're kind of boring, so yeah. I don't like to watch them. But whatever. So did you go? Do. Did you go to any any of those uh, uh, crazy? Did you, what did they do at the at the baseball stadium? Did they have a preacher or did they have some kind of? Yeah, they had a whole bunch of famous bands, and then they had the preacher. Oh, uh, Christian bands. Yeah. Did you see uh, uh, P.O.D.? No. How about? David Crowder. I don't know who that is. Yeah, they're more contemporary. Brian Kay. What? No, they were no no Deep no. Trouble shooter. Do you like that Christian music usually? Um, I don't know, kind of. Yeah. Sure. They're at the band. They had the bands there. Exciting bands in the stadium. Yeah, the stadium was packed out with people. It's cool. Lisa's mom is gonna be here soon. But do you know about any? Oh, she's not there yet. Not mm -hmm. yet. Do you know any news or topics that we can ask Lisa's mom? News topics. Oh. Or any um, topics, I guess. Otherwise. News topics. What is she? Uh, 
So it'll be interesting to find out if she's ever been on TV before. Oh, hey, it's, in, be it's info time. time. Oh. Here are some answers. Here are some answers to some frequently asked questions about the program. You're watching it right now, and it's called Your Daily Hour with me. It's on every day. That's seven days a week, 365 days a year, 366 on leap years. It's a call-in show that tapes at different times of the day. So when you call, leave a message, and we'll call you back. Anybody can come on the show, especially you. The program tapes in Olympia, Washington, and you can watch it on TCTV, Thurston County Channel 22, at 11.30 p.m. or on YouTube. It tapes a week in advance, so if you're watching on TCTV, this episode taped on the same day, was taped on the same day of the previous week. Please call in and tell your friends about the program. Your daily hour with me relies on the community for content. Thanks, and now back to the program. Yeah. <laughs> we hey, we're back. We didn't go anywhere. We didn't go anywhere. We're back from nothing. Freddie, we're back from nothing. <laughs> oh, Freddie's not back. <laughs> Freddie's <laughs> gone, I guess. <laughs> That's funny. Charlie, what are you doing over there? How come this thing's not on? This camera's supposed to be on. But okay, okay I have a funny story from California. Uh huh. Okay, so when me and James were waiting to go home, we were waiting in the waiting room of the airport. There was this Asian lady, and we were waiting there for like an hour, an hour and a half, two hours. Yeah. And this Asian lady was like sitting there meditating on, this, on the chair like next to us. And like for like a long time. Maybe like she was meditating. 40 minutes. Like, she, like her legs were crossed and her eyes were closed and her hands were out. Maybe like she was sleeping. Oh, she was doing like the whole like, 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 the, like this? Yeah. Uh -huh. she, she was doing that for a long time, and then she, like, changed, and she started, like, massaging her face, and then she started, like, massaging her feet or whatever. We were, we were like, whatever. And then all of a sudden, she stands up, and it looks like she's humping the air. Yeah. She's, like, literally, like, doing what? this weird uh. hump dance. <laughs> it was so funny, and this little boy was, like, watching her, and he was like, Mommy, help me. She's weird. Mommy. And he was, like, getting all scared. It was really funny. That's weird. Yeah, it was really weird. But it was really funny. I was laughing so hard. Why? Why? Yeah. Why were they doing that? We could try to dance. <laughs> I know. Whoa, Charlie's dancing. That's weird. Yeah, it was really weird. It was really funny though. You should have seen it. She was humping the air like. <laughs> like <laughs> was, was she tired? Was she tired or <laughs> you're freaking out? Maybe she was enlightened. <laughs> you're just doing it for the. She's doing it for everyone? Everyone, like, right in the middle of the aisle of where everyone was waiting, you know, to uh, get on their plane. In California? Yeah. And she was just, like, doing it. And we were, like, <laughs> James, like, showed me. And I was, like, oh, my gosh. And I always started laughing so hard. Was everybody staring? Yeah, the little boy was scared. He was, like, mommy, help me. She's scary. <laughs> She's scary. She was, like, crying help. halfway. Oh, no. They needed help. That's weird. <laughs> yeah, it was <laughs> really weird. I don't know. What did what did James think about that? James was laughing really hard. Uh huh. And he thought it was weird. I think it's weird too. Yeah. Really weird. But um. Yep. We ate a lot of sushi when we were in California. Oh uh, yeah. Like like what kind did you eat octopus? No. Oh my gosh. I James like had wanted me to try one of his, and I said I spit it out, and he called me ignorant. Oh. It was really. <laughs> what was it? It was like this octopus like salad thing. You didn't like it? No, I don't eat octopus. You didn't try it? No. I should try. I spit it out. Oh, that's ignorant. <laughs> no, it's not. You still got to try it. You, did you I did. It was in my mouth for a second, and then I spit it out because I didn't like it. Oh, okay. Have what? you had calamari? Yeah, I hate that. You do? Even fried up? Yeah. What do you like to eat? Sushi. Chicken? What, do you like a fish? Yeah. I, the only sushi I eat those California rolls because any other sushi would like literally make me think of like really gross things and then. Oh, well, California rolls got like got crab salad and nothing. I don't even. I know. Sushi. I <laughs> you know. eat California rolls in California. Yeah. They have good ones in Lakewood. You don't need to go to California for that. I know, but it was just like we just ate a lot of sushi because it was just like really easy. We didn't have to cook or anything, so. Mm. And it was really nice. Restaurants. All the houses that we stayed at, they always like cooked us breakfast when we got up in the morning. Whose house did you stay at? 
We stayed at Erica's grandma's, Erica's, um, Molly's. And then we stayed at this bed and breakfast place. It's like honeymoon bed and breakfast place in like San Francisco. It was like super nice. Mm. Like it was like really vintage and old. And yeah. All right. Well, here's a message from Mr. Ginsu. It's another one. Okay. That's it. So my fucking hands sitting there smelling like piss. I'm like, what no, the up. fuck? What? My hands smell like piss. What the fuck? And I picked up a fucking toolbox of mine, and the fucking thing smells like mouse piss. Oh no! In the corner with all that fucking chewed up shit. Oh god! So I could only imagine that that was a little pisser. Cause all I can say is, man, I grab hold of the handle of that thing and... Whoa, we gotta listen to all these oh, Gimsu messages before man. Lisa's mom gets here. She don't want to hear it. That was bad. She don't want to hear it? <laughs> she won't want to hear Mr. Gimsu. Why? Ed He's cursing. Oh, she doesn't curse? No, I don't know. Right. She's somebody's mother. Fucking uh, piss off, motherfuckers. Who, who was here? See. Those are her friends? Yeah. Mercedes brother live here too? Mm, I don't think so. Because when I, when I like, talking to your mic. When I rolled up in this driveway, this guy came out of the woodworks with like dreads and he was like, Who are you? Mm -hmm. He was like, Alex. Yeah, I'm coming on the show, yeah. Yeah, and then he was like, Cool. And then he left. And then uh -huh. these two other guys came and they went in the house. But the yeah. other guy never came back. So it was really weird. There, there are probably people who live here. I don't really know who uh, all who's in there. Oh, it's all they're all roommates. Mm, um, yeah, there's a, it's a house there. There's people in there. Well, I know, but... Um, yeah. you see anything on the streets? Yeah. Yeah? Um, I thought of something that I was going to tell you, but I forgot what it was now. Did you go on the L.A. freeway? Yeah, actually, we, it was really sad. We were in L.A. when we were, like, I, we had the convertible. We were driving around because James was freaking out, so I just started driving around for hours. You got a convertible? Yeah, we got a convertible. Where'd you get a convertible? This really sketchy Armenian guy. <laughs> oh, yeah. He was like, we were like calling places because I was like, I really want to get a car because like LA is so big and I want to like see places. Mm -hmm. And so I was like, well, I'm only 20. So I called and I was like, hey, where's the place that I can be like under 20 that, I mean, 20 years old that has a convertible. And so we called this guy and it's super sketchy. Like his sign says, 20 years old. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Like it was really weird. And so we go up there, and he like he's like it's basically like a weird, not even an office, like just like a weird, like cluttery place, like yeah. He like then I had to get insurance and stuff, and so then he like gave me the car, gave me the keys, gave me the lowdown. We drove the car around, whatever. Mhm. Mm so okay, this is another story. So then we we dropped the car off, and he was like, "It's okay. If the gate's locked, just reach your hand in, reach your hand into the mail slot, and drop the keys in there, and just leave." Yeah. Like, that's really weird. That's not, like, protocol at all for uh -huh. like, a professional, like, renting car place. Yeah. But we just did it anyway, so I dropped the keys in there. You think it was supposed to be, like, a crime car or something? That you, or some kind of crazy thing that you got yourself into? Or? It was just super sketchy, but whatever. We did it, and we dropped the car off, and you nothing happened. That? And yeah. you paid him? Yeah. It was only $100 a day because it was a convertible. That's it. So. That seems like a lot. Well, it's only $100. Alright, well, here's another Ginsu message. Alright, call 1 800 859 221 and get your free sample. I don't want a free sample. I'm TV, broken, interested in. Mr. Ginsu keeps trying to get me to no buy a sample, get your samples. <laughs> I don't want a sample, Mr. Ginsu. I told you that already, I think. Anyways, and then I was talking about L.A., so we were driving around for hours in L.A., and we, like, I think we drove past Skid Row, or, like, we drove past, like, a mission at night, and we saw, like, I, like, literally, like, all these homeless peoples, like, with tents, and they were, like, all super high. Like, this one lady, was, she was, like, like, had no clothes on, basically, like, a skirt on, and she was, like, pushing a car, and she was, like, falling over, and it was just, like, really sad. Whoa. Like, there's so, and, like, oh, yeah, and then we accidentally went through South Central L.A., which was, like, super sketchy at night. Can walking. we drive it? Oh, walking? Walking. Okay. Whoa. This was crazy. How and did you end up there? Well, because James is stupid, and he was like, let's go on this thing, whatever. And he, like, while he was on the bus, like, he wasn't even looking at his GPS to see where we were going. He was mm -hmm. like, we'll just get off wherever. That is never going to work. Yeah? Yeah. 
so, no more. Yeah. So I was like really mad at him, and so then we eventually just had to get off anyways because we were like already too far. So then he was like, "Oh my gosh, we have to get off now," and we had to walk super far through South Central LA at nighttime. Uh huh. Um, it was just really scary. There was like black people, like there was like shooters out. There was <laughs> garbage everywhere. <laughs> there were like, shooters. Yeah, there were shooters. How do you know? Because we saw them running with the guns. You saw a gun? Yeah. You saw people with guns? Yeah, they were running across the street. What? They were running? Yeah. Running with guns? Yes. Oh, that's dangerous. Don't run with guns. You gotta walk. <laughs> it was really scary. What? Did that nobody mess with you though? No, James was like, Alex, you're gonna get raped. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah. So he's like trying to walk hella fast, and uh -huh. I wasn't, and I don't know. It was just like, and then it was so funny, like but super funny. You, you didn't get hassled at all? No, because James was with me, probably. Oh, uh, okay. Well, I did, actually. When we were in San Francisco, there was this homeless guy. No, but they had in LA, though. Yeah, I know. How did you guys make it out of there? You guys, you guys just ran through? No, we walked through really fast, and all these black people were like, where are you going? Where are you guys going? Da, da, da. So like, they were nice? Yeah, but they were trying to get our stuff. Oh. Uh, like, are were, you sure? Like, undercover nice. Uh, I don't know. What if they're just really nice? No. Not no, you sure? Guns. Well, they have guns because other people in South Central are going to try to steal from them. Maybe. Some, I think most of them are nice. I think it's okay. Charlie, you ready for the dice game? Here we go. One and... Oh, yeah, I got a point, huh? One and three? Three, I guess. Wait, which one was it? I don't know. I think it was this one. Oh, no, you don't know? I think it was that one, for sure. One and three. Are you sure? Yeah. So he won again. Charlie won again. But you got one. Or you got 500 points. Charlie, a thousand points though. I got Charlie, you're winning again. He has a thousand. Yeah, he has a thousand. You have 500. Dang, he's he can't even talk and he's already winning. Yeah, he's winning. Charlie, you won again. He's been, he's been on a streak. He's so cute. Charlie, yeah. But yeah, so. No bugging, huh? The whole time. It was really funny. James's friend was like, "What are you guys doing out there at nine o'clock at night? Are you guys like praying to the thugs?" <laughs> Really Praying to the thugs. Yeah. Hey. Uh -huh. I got a question for you. Uh, what's that? What the fuck? Oh uh -huh, yeah. Motherfucker. That sounds like Lewis Hamilton. That was his message. You think Mr. Ginsu sounds like Lewis? Yeah. What? <laughs> Just like that message. He left two more messages. Wow. Did you tell people to watch the program in California? Hey, I got a question for you. No, he didn't. It was <laughs> female tractor, saved <laughs> the male tractor. Okay, scoot a little closer, John Deere. What? Eh, fucking get it? No. Yeah. What is it? Hey, I got a question for you. You're playing this again? It was the female tractor, saved oh, the male what tractor. Is, oh, yeah, what did he say? Okay. Good little plunker, John Deere. Good little plunker, John Deere? <laughs> I don't know what the joke is. I don't get the joke. Really All right, well, we have one more message from him. I don't get the joke. So, Mr. Gensi, if you're watching, you can call and tell us the joke a little bit slower and <laughs> enunciate more. Or um, explain it. Yeah. Maybe it's just over our heads. Maybe. What's a plunker? <laughs> I don't know. I don't think he said that. Oh. Hey, I was wanting to call you to ask you to put me in case I forgot. Come I down there and kick you. Really you just be on the show right now. And fucking you think so? Be mysterious. He's not that mysterious. break his mystery, but we don't know what he looks like or who he is. I'll hunt him down. You're gonna find out? Yeah. yeah. You just gotta give me some information. We have a phone number. No. Yeah. So, anyway. I have to have a fucking thing to find out now. Fucker. Where? Aww. No, Charlie. Did you go to church when when you're in California, like regularly? Or? Yeah, we did. We went to this place called Bethel Church, um, in Redding, California. Yeah. In Redding, California, we stay with these lesbians. Oh yeah. Yeah. You okay with that? 
Yeah. You didn't tell them that that's against Jesus or something? No. Okay. I didn't. That's good. We stayed with them, and so then we went to church with them. Oh, they go to church? No. Well, one of them does. Like, one of them, like, has been to church. Like, one of them, like, believes in Jesus. Uh Uh-huh. But, like, doesn't want to not be a lesbian. Yeah. So, it's whatever, though. (laughs) So, we went to church with her and her, like, this other girl that lives with them. And James went, and I went. And it was, like, really, really good. I really, really enjoyed it. Uh Bethel Church is, like, a landmark in, like, the Christian world. It's, like, it's so huge. It's everyone. The the wedding churches? Yeah. It's crazy. Uh. Yeah, it's, like, super, super cool. What about your your home church? Were they mad that you went to California? No. Uh, Oh, they're okay with it? Yeah, they don't care. You okay? Yeah. All right. So let's call Dan. He's supposed to be here tomorrow. Dan Bennett, he's back from Canada. Canada. I almost said, I almost said California, yeah. Mm-hmm. It's like Canada. <laughs> here we go, calling Dan. I don't know if he's I'll back. Bring, I'll bring James on the show like a day next week. Oh, uh, okay. Well, yeah, where's the calendar? Are you going to bring him on Wednesday? Yeah. I don't know what. Yeah, we're going to be outside on Wednesday. We're going to be setting stuff up so outside. Oh, no. When you stand up, yeah, or it gets Charlie excited. You see the calendar? No. Come on, Charlie. Up, up, here's. Come here. And now, behold, you have reached Lord Donald's new call and his telephone machine choice. You must leave a message. Blah, 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 blah. Or if you do not, I will send my minions out to the ship. But yeah, I'll bring him Wednesday, so are you guys, what time are you guys like, actually taking the show? Uh, 3. 30. 3. 30? Hey, Dan. Yeah, th- Dan, are you? Hello? Why, why? 3. 30 is crazy? Hey, Dan, you there? <laughs> no, I don't want to. You, you screening your phone calls? Hey, Dan? Dan! Hello? Dan? Mother Mary is calling you. You want to be earlier than 3.30? Because I'm going to Seattle that night. I'm going to City Church with my friend, so I wanted to be kind of early so I didn't get crazy parking. Oh, uh, well, we might do it early. We could find out. You could just call in. How about just 2.30? 2.30. Well, I guess we'll play it by ear on the day. Whatever. And see who shows up to it, because it's going to be a lot of people showing up to it, maybe. Really? Well, I don't know. Probably not. <laughs> it's going to be... Uh, that's on Wednesday, though. Yeah, so, yeah. You're going to bring James on there? You can get that day. It doesn't matter. That's everyone's day. Oh, so, yeah. You should get the other days, too, then. Get a day on... On the, on the week after. Well, at the I'll end of September. I'll let you know. Yeah, okay. <laughs> it's uh, Rosh Hashanah tonight. <laughs> For us. What's a Rosh Hashanah? Rosh Hashanah, it's a Jewish holiday. Is Amy a new girl on the show? Amy? 27th? Uh, yeah, she's a new person. She hasn't been on yet. Oh, really? Yeah, so she's going to come on. She wants to turn Olympia into a movie town, apparently, but I don't think that's going to fly too well because of people. Uh, Did she call you guys and say that and leave a message? Yep. Are you calling her right now? No, we're calling Desmond. Okay. Uh, oh, no, I saw Desmond's hair on uh, one yeah. of the episodes. It's, it's really crazy. Me, man. Get back he has crazy second. hair. The mailbox is full. Kind of, okay. Okay. Do you know that guy that like that like transvestite guy that has like blonde hair and he's like it's a hair flip, it's a hair flip. Do you know that guy? Like the guy that likes Britney? Yeah. What's his name? Is it Chris something or? Oh yeah, isn't it Jeffrey Star? The guy, the guy that says like leave Britney alone. Yeah, he's crying. Yeah. That's what his hair reminds me <laughs> of. You think Desmond like that guy? Yeah. That's funny. Who is that guy? Maybe that guy is is that is that Desmond? No. No, he's not another. Hair? No, actually, yeah, no. He's secret. That's that's what he secretly. That guy's doesn't. super funny though. It's a hair flip. It's just a hair flip. Yeah. It's really funny. So his hair. When I saw it at when I, before I came here, I, I was like, oh my gosh, looks like that guy. He's like the guy on on the thing. Like a girl guy. A girl guy. He's, he's very. Definitely, you look like a girl guy. <laughs> he's very European. Are you gonna come on the show at the, uh, on the end of the month here? Um. I don't know. Oh, you don't sure. know. Did you go? Did you go to any uh, McDonald's there in California? Yeah, I got a cone and a pie. Uh, apple pie? Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna be Wednesday, and then Thursday is the 
finale and then Friday's a kickoff? Yep. So I'll probably come Wednesday and Friday. Okay. We'll come on with the Swedes. What's the Swedes? Oh, the Sweden. Dance, holy dance. Oh, cool. I know some from Dance, holy dance. Live TV dance party. First Friday of each month. 8 p.m. to 9 p.m. TCTV Studio A. 440 Yager Way. Oh, yeah. Okay. It might be up tomorrow on the program. It might be have to be a Yeah. And in tonight's episode, I report about my trip to Canada. I was there for a week. I went to the Space Sciences Center. I went to the West Edmonton Mall. I went to the New Tark Conservatory. Conservatory. I rode on the Canadian subway. It was exciting. There were thrills. There were spills. And... Uh, it's the program. Every night, 11.30, give us a call. Call in. Thanks, everybody. Yep. You should be on television. You. Yeah, <laughs> I'll bring it. I also have some VHSs. Some yeah, VHSs. more VHSs. Hey, uh, we're back. Hello. More VHSs. Yeah. We're going to do that. That's going to be a good time. We're about to call some McDonald's here. You ready for that? Are you excited? No. <laughs> I think something more interesting to call, like, the government or, like, the FBI or something. Yeah, we're calling San Francisco. You went there, right? This is Taylor Street. Did you go to Taylor Street? Probably. Yeah, we did. I remember. I remember, yeah. Did, did you see uh, Alcatraz? Yeah, we you went. Did? We went sailing in the bay. Whoa! Sailing official. How'd really you do that? This guy took us. We saw some guy, and he's like, "We're taking people sailing," and we got on there. Was yeah. It, was it nice? Yeah, he gave James two beers. Oh yeah. Well, he didn't need to give James two beers, but he did anyways. While he was sailing. I mean. The guy was it a professional sailing guy or is it? Yeah. It's a professional. I really didn't see like a lot of gay people. Like I didn't see a lot of gay couples. In San Francisco. I saw people that could be gay, but you never know. But I didn't see a lot of like couples walking around that were gay. In San Francisco, you thought you'd see more? Yeah. Uh. I mean, I, s I don't know. I mean, there was this gay couple in our uh, honeymoon suite room place. Yeah. But. Did you talk to them? He said hi. But you had a honeymoon too? Yeah, did you tell, you said the people that you were married, right? You and James were married yeah. or something? How did that work out? It was good. We actually got a bottle of wine and they didn't even, we went down there to the kitchen to open it and the guy didn't even ask how old I was. He, was just, he didn't even say anything. Uh-huh. Because I was like, James, I'm really scared. Like, I'm not 21. And he was like, it's fine. Yeah. I'm not even going to ask because I think we're probably married already. So, I was like, okay. Did you <laughs> think you were married? Yeah. Did you have a face of earrings? Yeah, he he always has a ring on his hand, and I just have like I put a little wi ring on, like a little whatever. A little thick ring. Yeah. Is it like a little heart shaped bed or something? No, it's just a it's just a. No, the bed though. Oh. <laughs> and they have a heart shaped bed. No, right? the bed was really cool. It was like, and okay, we we Mother Mary's like praying kneeling stool was like in our room, like uh -huh. it was really old, like really uh, what's that word? I don't know. Old timey. Yeah, but like like artifacts. Uh, antique. Yeah, really antique. Antique furniture. Okay. Hey, there she is. Hi. Uh, we're trying to call it some McDonald's. <laughs> They're not answering. They're there. Yeah, the McDonald's aren't answering. Uh oh. Okay. Oh, McDonald's. Hi, McDonald's. Yeah. Do you guys have those pumpkin pie milkshakes yet? No, not yet. Uh, do you know if you're gonna get them in soon? Huh? Do you know if you're gonna get them? In, do you know if you're gonna get them in soon? Uh, we have them, but we still can't sell them until we finish the s'more pies. No, oh, what about the pumpkin pie milkshake? S'more pies? No s'mores. Oh. What about the what about the pumpkin pie milkshakes? You just asked about. Uh, we're gonna start selling those probably next week on Monday. The, not the pies, the milkshakes. Oh, the milkshake? Yes. Uh, I still don't know. We still don't have the product that yet. Oh, but the other ones are just in the freezer? 
The pie, the pumpkin pie? Hello? Uh, no, somebody's still there. Hello? Oh. They actually have pumpkin pies. Oh, I think they're hung up now. Here they Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, you can come on TV. We're talking on the program here. It's Lisa's mom. <laughs> Here's the... Oh, we, gotta, we should have cleaned up a little bit. Oh, I don't, oh, yeah. I don't, oh yeah, that's my good Hi. Here you go. Lisa's uh, getting her mom on the phone. She wants her mom on TV. Charlie, come here. Charlie, what are you eating? Charlie found some on the, on the... Did you guys feed him? Did you feed him? Just talking to the... In the like a phone. Okay. Did you... Are we on radio? Uh, no, we're on TV. Oh, TV. We're on TCTV. Lisa's on TCTV, too. This is Alex. Hello. Hey, uh, yeah. Hi, Alex. Hi. Nice to meet you. How are you? Uh, can you talking to the... It's like a okay. phone. Yeah, like, like it's a phone. Okay. I'll put it like, like a that. phone. Yeah, that's okay. it. Have you ever been on TV before? I've never been on TV that I was aware of. Uh, but... You think you might have been on TV that you didn't yeah, you know? Were. When was I on TV? You were interviewed one time oh. because of a drag race on Mulholland oh, Drive. That's true. I was on the news. You're right. But that was so long ago, I can't remember. Uh, how long ago? Um, tell them the story. It's a really well, good you, story. Well, you know about the story? or Was that before you were born or something? Or? I was born. Oh, uh, okay. The guy who knocked on the door. Oh, Charlie. Oh, he's excited. The guy knocked on the door one time because of his car. Because of Dead Man's Car. Oh, yes. We are. Tell the story. Okay. Well, there's a lot of stories. <laughs> like Charlie, stay down. Uh, let's see. What can we say? We live up on Mulholland Drive. Uh-huh. Oh. <laughs> what? <laughs> what, what, what? What did she say? I live uh, in, the, in the area. I live in the area. You can say where you live. Okay. And um, sometimes we have drag racers. Uh-huh. And drag racers come out like at all hours of the night. And uh, some nights when we first moved into our house, we'd have knocks at the door between midnight, 2, 3 in the morning that people's cars went off the cliff. Uh, at a whoa. Of dead man's curve. Ooh. Yeah. Whoa. So that was kind of dangerous. Charlie's stepping on, on the Charlie. controls. Oh, my God. <laughs> Well, Charlie always controls things. Uh -huh. That's why he's stepping on the controls. Yeah, Charlie's a good boy. He's my stepson. Or my grandson. What are you? You live <laughs> with us. Yeah. Okay, so anyway, yes, we've had uh, situations where um, in the middle of the night, people would come knocking at our door uh, for wine glasses because they were drinking wine, but they didn't have glasses to drink uh, wow. wine from. And what? Uh, just all sorts of They needed glass? They needed wine That's weird. glasses. And sometimes they need the, to use the bathroom. Did you give it to them? Never. Were they a drag racer, though? They were drag racers. Were they racers. drinking they and, were, and driving? They were heavy-duty drag racer, drinkers, uh, oh, no. winos, uh, probably on drugs. They were a combination. Oh, no. Did combo. you? A combo. Did you, did you call the police? or did, Oh, did all you the time. We had the police in our driveway all the time. Oh, man. You tell oh, them about these... God. Yeah, drag racers. How come if they're so, if they're so like uh, drugged out in drag racing, how come they're not just drinking out of the bottle? Well, they're not supposed to be <laughs> doing those. <laughs> um, Everything they're doing up there is illegal. Yeah, but, but the <laughs> police but yeah, aren't glasses. always able to catch <laughs> yeah, them. They're doing Charlie. all this like crazy illegal stuff, but they still want wearing glasses. That's and right. And they don't want to go yeah, use the bathroom outside. Somehow. Right. They yeah. don't want to. <laughs> pee in the um, bushes, so yeah. they need to go inside <laughs> the house. Charlie. Charlie thinks he's a lap dog. He's That's very excited. Oh, he, he loves you. He hasn't yet. He, oh, he, he hasn't. loves you. <laughs> uh, have you seen him yet? <laughs> oh, wow. He's good. Oh, oh, oh he's so excited. Oh, he's too excited. Okay, sit, Charlie. Oh, my God. Oh, he's been... He's never been this excited. Oh, well, he's my baby. We've had him on the show. He's been he coming on. for six months at our house, and now he remembers my voice. Oh, yeah. Good dog. Oh, Charlie, good boy. boy. Sit. Sit down. Sit. sit. Charlie, don't freak out so much. Yeah. Well, you guys got here for the end of the show. Yeah, we still have about ten minutes left today. Okay. Uh, this is exciting. Is Lisa a, a, a good child? Did she get in trouble at school? Lisa never got in trouble. No Lisa trouble? Was Never. Lisa was a perfect child. Yeah. She really was. She's a good girl. That's good.
No yeah. trouble? No, no detention? Never. No calls home? Never. Not one? I would never hear anything bad about Lisa from the school. Oh, wow. Yeah, she's a good girl. Hey. She always follows directions and she did her homework. It's time for the dice game. Are we rolling dice? We're gonna, yeah, we're going to roll the dice. We have, uh, you can run a number in your hand no. or on a piece of paper. You guys want to play? I can. See, only if you have paper. Only if we have paper. Right yeah, you can write on, the, on this. Okay. So but you pick a number between one and six. But, uh, what? Charlie's already winning. Yeah, Charlie. he's a thousand points. He has a thousand points. Did he win? Um, I think he's going to win, really, because okay. it's a good chance. Okay. <laughs> Lisa, you want to you wanna okay, do? Yeah. You want to be on Charlie's team? <laughs> Lisa likes to be on Charlie's team, usually. Charlie! You remember me! You're such a good boy. Sit. Sit down. Ah! Oh, oh my he's God. Looking, he's looking, he's looking. There we go, you want to Yeah. Oh, uh, Talking to the phone, but he's sitting on part four of the and five. Oh. Four and five. Four and five. I got one point. What did you have? One. one. Four. Four. You have five. Oh, you got five hundred oh, points. You might have more points, but I forgot what the other numbers were. Oh. Four. Yep. Well, I think you won. You and Charlie can both be your winners now because you have the numbers. Because Charlie won from before, but you just got a point. But I did two. I think there might have been a four earlier too. So I think you and Charlie have tied. For the oh, win. That's very exciting. Charlie, you and I are co-winners. Yeah. That means you're going to get another treat. Oh, uh, good. Sit down. You have to sit. I don't give treats unless you sit. And Charlie, sit. Oh, uh, don't, sit don't, don't chew the record. Yeah. No, no, He's no. very excited. He's been coming on the show a lot, and I don't think I've ever seen him this riled up. Well, he just remembered who I was. Yeah. For a while, it was kind of anonymous, but don't oh, eat the cord. Did you? Oh, no. Oh, my God. No, no, don't eat that cord, Charlie. going to get <laughs> Whoa, he's too crazy. Charlie, go see. <laughs> Char Ah, Charlie! Get him out! Get, get, get. <laughs> no. Charlie, get out! Get out! Oh, uh, uh, Charlie's getting taken up! Oh wow! Okay. Oh man! Oh, <laughs> Charlie! Yeah, calm the dog down. Just like, give him a sit. Charlie, sit. Sit down. Sit. Yeah. Charlie, sit. Oh, he's freaking out. You're a good boy. Yeah, you know it's me. You know that I'm your mommy. Yeah. Your other mommy. You recognize oh, man. my voice. Do you, uh, Good boy. Do you know any famous people? Do I know famous uh -huh. people? You're from L.A., right? Well, I just yeah. met you. So uh -huh. yeah. uh, me too. Are you any, are any California famous people, though? California. She just went to, She just came from L.A., really? right, on the well, trip. What did you see in L.A.? Anybody? You didn't see anybody. L.A.? No, I didn't see anyone. You never, you never know when you're going to run into Yeah, somebody. you never know. And they, they look so ordinary. Yeah. With them in person, you wouldn't even know that it's them. Yeah. Uh -huh. Except for the paparazzi, then you'll see. Right. Did you then see the paparazzi? Papar okay. No. Well, can I say one person? No. No. Okay. Don't say Lisa says you can't. You can. You can. I'm not going to do anything them. against my daughter's wishes because my daughter's in charge. Oh, she's in charge of the show Lisa's now. Lisa's a director. Yeah. She tells me what to do. <laughs> so I have to follow Lisa's her keeping, keeping it. Uh, yeah. There's some celebrity news. People, Lisa's stopping us from hearing it. Yeah, I'm kind of like a celebrity. Uh -huh. I came with Charlie. I mean, it, Charlie yeah. and I drove up with Lisa from L.A. last year, and we were like celebrities at the hotel, weren't we, Charlie? Yeah, yeah. everybody loved talking to you. Um, what did you see? Did, did you see anything in L.A. that, or that you uh, maybe you went to the same place? Uh, Where did you go in L.A.? We went all around Hollywood and the hills. Yeah? South, yeah, everywhere. All right. Well, let's see. We're going to have about, uh, about five minutes left here. Uh, so you're, you're from California. Is that where you were from before? Well, if you, you expected a little bit of an accent, I'm from Chicago. Oh, uh, Chicago. Yeah, I'm a Chicagoan. But now yeah, Charlie. Yeah. <laughs> Are you so excited still? Oh, you're such a good boy. Yeah. You're a good boy. Have you seen Lisa's show? You know, I've seen some of them on On, on the YouTube there? Oh, no, don't there. bite the cord, Charlie. Use the cord. Come here. You do that when you're normally on TV. No, he's he's really riled up. Me. He's just just for, just you. for you. He's usually yeah. he was just like lying down. He uh, was very calm. Yeah, he's very calm he before. He remembers me. He got excited. You're a very beautiful dog. Yeah, we love Charlie. Yeah, uh, you do you do you go to In and Out Burger? Um, my son goes there all the time. Yeah. Yes, he, that's uh, he goes to the one on Hollywood Boulevard. Wow. Uh, yeah, but um. They have long lines there. Uh -huh. yeah. That food must be really good for all those people to be standing in line waiting to get hamburgers. <laughs> I know. 
All right, well, here's the call. We're, we're calling some McDonald's. That's what we're doing. We can call some a couple more while we're on the on the show here. And what are you calling McDonald's for? <laughs> we're, we're just gonna ask <laughs> That's him. What I say. Oh yeah. Uh oh, Charlie he stepped on something. He knocked out the the phone number. Different people's voices and different <coughs> accents. Jones. Oh okay. Uh, Managers for Bank of America. Uh oh, what the? That was not McDonald's. Did a wrong number. That was wrong. Uh oh. Yeah. Do you watch uh, public access down there in LA? Uh, I watch public access if I have time, which is very little. Mm -hmm. But uh, it's a good it's a good thing. Do you uh, you drive around in a convertible? Uh, no, because it messes up my hair. Uh huh. How about? Uh, you can get sunstroke. You know, we've had, it's been a hundred and four. Oh wow. Hundred and ten. This last week, it was a little abusive. Oh. Too hot. And yeah. then you would get like a really bad, um, swollen head. Yeah. Are you just visiting? Yes, oh, I'm yeah. just visiting. She's oh. in LA. Oh, yeah, so you live I in LA. Stay in LA. Yeah, oh. I just came back from New York, and I turned around and I got on a plane to come here. Oh. Have you, I'm have such you, a world trail. Yeah. Uh, yeah. How about, uh, have you been to any red carpet events? you go to those things? Red carpet. Uh -huh. There's a red carpet outside my bathroom. Uh -huh. We have to walk on there to get <laughs> to the bathroom. All right. Yeah, I'm not into red carpets because it's hard to clean them. Uh-huh. What, what about, like, uh, you, you ever seen, you ever try to go to those uh, L.A. stuff? You go to the LA free, free screenings, free movie free screenings, screenings and stuff? There's nothing in L.A. that's free. Oh, you yeah. Or you have to stay out for three days in order to get a seat. And I don't really think it's worth it. I'd rather uh -huh. watch it on TV. To be an extra. Do you ever, you ever do entertainment industry uh, stuff, though? No, I don't think they think I'm very entertaining, and nobody's ever offered me an extra part. Uh -huh. They don't really feel I can do anything well, so they kind of keep clear of me. But I live in the, I, I live in the Hollywood Hills. So oh, wow. Living. Did you go up in the yeah. Hollywood Hills, Lisa? <laughs> yeah? Is she, she's not, is she, she's very embarrassed? Right, it's embarrassing. She's embarrassed. You know, is, it, is that like the Kardashians? Uh, not no, quite. not I quite. Don't <laughs> they, I don't think no, the Kardashians live in the hills. They in Laurel Canyon. They, they live in an upper neighborhood. Oh, uh, I've heard of that. Upper, uh, neighborhood. I, I've never been there, but I've heard of all these places. They live in places, Calabasas, so. I think. Oh, yeah? They live in, oh, I know where they live. They live in this garden community out there, probably, where nobody can get in unless you get them. Get through the, the guard station. Oh, really? Did you see, did you see the, the movie? Uh, you, uh, you can say anything on TV. It's fine. Lisa got these roles. Uh, she's right. making up roles for the program. Yeah, They're in real. The next thing I know, the Kardashians will be doing. The Kardashians. I told, I told everybody <laughs> where they live. I, uh, I think people know. The internet will tell us about that kind of thing. Well, that's true. Go on the internet, everybody. Oh, uh oh. Dang it, I hung up on them right when they answered. Well, I was hanging up. I was hanging up. Lost McDonald's. Yeah, we lost them. I was calling them, oh but, God, but then the I decided that they, they had been ringing too long, and then I pressed hang up, and then they right when they answered, I I had hung up. So well, they're probably busy getting their um, McDonald's stuff ready for dinner. Yeah. <laughs> their Mick Mac and their Mick Eggs and their Mick Muffins and their Mick everything. Yeah, I, I've heard of Mulholland Drive though. You seen that? Is do you live on actual Mulholland Drive? Am I allowed to answer? Oh that, yeah, it's very really no. big. She doesn't know. It's like the movie. I can't remember where I live. I'm so forbidden. Yeah, uh, she. I, Lisa I wanted you to come on the program. They use in Olympia. But now you have all these secrets. You don't want your mom to tell on the program even after you invited her on. But thanks for coming on. It's the end of the show. Oh no, I'm done. This yeah. Is my extra part is <laughs> yeah. over. It was the end. end. Yeah, you How get. How did you, I do? I think you did great. Was I okay? Yeah. Okay. Can I come Fantastic. back? Fantastic. Yeah. Charlie. How long are you gonna be in town for? Just 24 hours. Oh wow. Yeah, I. And I move out. Quick. Thanks, YouTube. Yeah, YouTube. It's very exciting. Thank <laughs> you. Am I going to be famous? Yeah. yeah. Thanks, Facebook. <laughs> okay, I want to be famous. Thanks, Twitter. Bye, thanks, Twitter. Tweet. Thanks, TCTV, Others in County. Dave, thanks, Days. Thanks, Crew. Crew. So there's a big crew in here. Yeah. And Charlie's in charge. I think Lisa, yeah, Lisa and Charlie on the crew. Yeah, Thanks, those are viewers. The I know. Oh, oh, here you comes. remember me. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, heard CCTV. Me. 26 you're, years. You're such a good boy. USA. You. You Go bet. USA. Lebigo.com, check it out. Arrivederci. <laughs> Hell yeah, dog. Hasta la vista, baby. Hell yeah, Charlie. Sayonara. I'm from California. <laughs> remember who said that? Bye bye. Bye 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 bye. Are we doing a commercial? Mm-hmm. Let me do a commercial.
Are we coming back? Yeah. Well, yeah.